what you can see here uh all 4g wi-fi modem that i got from uh, aliexpress this and this is supposed to be the same so these are identical okay and here is another one 4g light modem as well and uh, the reason why I have this one in the park is because of uh, what happened or my experience with this 4G model. So I got all of this from uh, AliExpress. But the shocking thing is that none of them is working as we speak. Yes, let me prove that to you. So this is my USB power bank. Since these are modern uh, wireless, I usually plug them to this 5 volts uh, outlet. That's how I've been using it for years. So I plug this. And can you see the red light? Yes. So this have been using this power bank for some months until one day I plugged it and all I could see is just this red light and nothing more. It does nothing apart from showing the red light. And that's to show you that the modem is having fault. So when I leave it like this, it's gonna remain like this till the end of today. Or probably go off okay it's on again the reason why I'm making this video is just to confirm that this modern is no longer working So it's off again. So it keeps coming on and off. Now I'm gonna try this this one. Now what happened to this is very very uh, unbelievable. This modem only worked for about five minutes. I was trying to install it. Everything started browsing, and before five minutes, that was the end. That was how the modem stopped working. So, as I'm speaking with you right now, what I have here is a 40 modem. All right, now if you can take a very good look at this. This is pretty new, very very new. This one worked for 24 hours. What happened is that I got both of them almost at the same time. So I started using this one. Then along the line, I said, let me get something in case anything happens to this. So I got this one. And when this one eventually went bad, I brought out this one and. Uh, the next 24 hours this one went bad and each of these cost uh, at least more than twenty dollars let's see Nothing, get nothing. Sorry, I'm kind of doing this with one hand. There is the other one.
nothing nothing so only this one can have just the, have the light come on but that's the only thing it does so like i said i would like to take you to the um, page so that you see how long i've been using each of these that is those that actually stayed for some months then also see how much i spent on four of them now something is kind of telling me that they're actually five just that i can lay my hand on the fifth one but i will confirm when i uh, uh, go into my account on aliexpress as you can see this one actually came with this this one works for five minutes or thereabouts and it stopped working that's why i still have the pack with me now now here comes the question what is really wrong with modems from aliexpress are they fake or are they too cheap i don't actually know what to say right now because as i'm speaking with you we have 4g modem in my country but i had to go to a nearby local store to get a 3g during the pandemic so i can be online so what i'm waiting for now is um for this uh, lockdown to ease so i can order another 4g modem from china i want to be testing testing until i get a good and reliable modem from china well something is telling me that it's time i try the the ones that comes with battery i don't know what i will try next but i will surely get another modem from china because if i if i check the speed of my browsing now on a 3g modem and the speed i got from any of these it can be compared so i need 4g modem in my life so let's go to the page let me analyze and you see how much it cost me to get all this all right you walk onto my screen just want to give you a brief description on how i got this model right the first model you're seeing was purchased on may 19 2017 Then after some weeks, I felt that I should just make this modem too. So from May 19, 2017, I had to make another order on June 28, June 28, 2017. And since then, I've been having this modem all along with me but never used this this one i was only making use of of this so this first one worked from 2017 to about july 2019. Uh, this is how this is what happens the next one i had to buy was uh, July 2019 and the reason why I had to order a new modem on this day is because these two stopped working so this is how it happened this one stopped working and then uh, I had to go and get the other one which is this and I started using this one and this one stopped working after 24 hours so that led me to order for another 4G modem in 2019 around July 2019 and to my greatest surprise this modem only worked for about 5 minutes 
five minutes, I was devastated. And I said, okay, what can I do? So from July, I had to summon courage. This is October 22nd, 2019. I had to get the last modern part of the four. And behold, I got this in the month of um, November. And uh, I used this between November and um, March 2020. And that was how the modem stopped working. So, from my own um, observation, let me quickly, quickly give you a breakdown of how everything happened. Because I can still remember. So it means that this particular modem, which is, which is the first 4G modem I got, worked between um, the month of, um, let's say, June 2017 to July 2019. Yes. This is about two years. If you want, I'm going to pull up the chart for you so you can see. This is modem number one. It worked between June 20, sorry, yeah, June 2017 to July 2019. That is approximately two years or 24 months. This one stopped working July 2019. How to, to start using this one? And this one gave up after 24 hours. So I had to go and get a new order for a new one. This one came in and this one worked for five minutes. Five minutes. So I used this one between the month of August 2019 and it died that same month. And the last one. Here, I got on October 22nd, 2019, worked till March 2020, and that is the end. Now, this is a big question what is going on with this modem from AliExpress? I did my research and I discovered that this modem, in particular, this one and this, though they don't look alike, but they are practically the same thing in the sense that the content or what inside the modem tend to be exactly the same thing even though the covering are not and I begin to wonder would this be a, a fraudulent way of uh, selling one product in two different forms I don't know so this is what I want to prove to you this modem you are seeing here you can see it which is exactly this one See the resemblance? You can see it. It's actually the same model with this. So what I'm trying to let you know is that these two models are the same, exactly the same thing. So I'm going to put that in my next video. Even though they don't have the same casing, they're almost the same height. They are not exactly the same thing. But what inside this modern is exactly the same. Now, 
who, who would have imagined that body like this and something like this will do the same thing? Well, I'll prove that to you in my next video. Hope this helps you in, in, in a way to understand what's actually going on. If you ask me to say what happened here, I would think um, for this modern that works, though these two, these two moderns are identical, I got both of them in 2017. This one worked for two years. And when this one packed up, I brought this one. And uh, in the next 24 hours, this one gave up. This is kind of a um, lifespan uh, thing. I think it has expired. That's why they're just, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just guessing. So I decided to go for something new recent because these modems are. Uh, they, they are new on AliExpress. Decided to go for something modern, but at the same time, I got disappointed. So, I will talk more on these two modern later in my next video. Now, what are my suggestions? When you go to the sales page of all this, any of these modern, you will see that them. Um, you will often be told that uh, you can plug this to any USB outlet. But there's something they forgot to tell us that the USB outlets have different uh, amps and uh, yeah, the voltage is 5 for all, but the amps are not the same. We have some outlets that gives out, gives out uh, 2.0 amps, and others give out uh, 1 amp. And others half or uh, 0.5 amps. None of these companies are telling us the exact amps that this thing require. And to be honest with you, I plug these things on outlets that gave out uh, 2. Point, uh, um, 2 point 2.1. So when next I'm going to get, if I'm going to get this kind of modem, I will always make sure that I always plug it on outlet with uh, 0.5 amps. Yes, that's what I'm going to do, depending on the kind of modem I get next. And I also want to get that from AliExpress. So I'll make sure that I, I plug this to my laptop and my laptop alone, and no power banks, just to know if I can be able to find out the reasons why these things are, you know, going bad. Because if you want to check how much I spent on this, a quick um, calculation, right? Going for the first one, this one costs twenty eight ninety nine. Twenty eight. 28 dollars then the next one June 28.99 as well plus 28.99 then this one cost uh, 16.34 34 and um, the last one the last one is um, 1916 so can you see this I spent almost hundred dollars and uh, it's not something good at all not something good at all. So this hundred dollar is just a waste. Well, like I said, I'm gonna dig deep and I'm gonna find out what exactly happened. So until then, remain blessed and like always, have a very nice day.